What's up everybody? So Sunday is gonna be the first race here in Mexico for me and uh, the Red Dragon right here needs a fresh 120 on the rear. So gonna be throwing that on using the Baja no pinch tire tool. And I've actually never been able to put a tire on by myself without pinching the tube. So if this tool works as good as they say it does, then I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna test it out and let you guys know how good it works. So here it is guys, this is the Baja no pinch tire tool. Comes with these replacement sleeves for different size axles. Uh, I'm going to be using the purple one, I got a Honda so. And it's pretty simple design, see how good it works. What's up guys? So it's the next day and I decided I'm gonna change the front tire as well. I just feel like I need to learn this tool a little bit better to give it a fair shot at a review right now. Got the front tire on, so two for two, no pinch tubes. The tool definitely works well. Uh, I think if you were really good at using tire spoons, you could change it just as quickly, but for me, I found it a lot easier. I think a lot of people will too. A um, Couple times I got the hook stuck in the tire between the rim and I had to dig it out with the spoon. That was pretty much the biggest problem that I had. But other than that, it works really well. So also, I just want to point out that I didn't have a few things. Um, I didn't have a bead buddy. That would have been really helpful, and I think I'm going to get one for next time. But uh, also, I did not have a tire stand, 
and I actually started using uh, an orange bucket to put the wheel in and change the tire on and that worked really well. I'm actually not even going to buy a tire stand. And uh, other than that, yeah, I did it with two tire spoons and the Baja No Pinch Tire Tool.